<clears throat> Hi! Minecon 2013 is going to be held in Orlando, Florida. Anything else to really talk about? Nope. That's right, Minecraft tonight. In case if you missed my little showcase video from Minecon, it was my first ever little skit in Minecraft. Sure, we do music videos and everything else that makes millions of views, but it's my first little skit. Yay! But Mojang did come out with their own video as well to showcase that Minecon 2013 will be held in Orlando, Florida. Sometime in July, which is my birthday, they're going to announce tickets and hotel information so you guys can go ahead and buy it and get your hotel set up. Now as for all your Minecraft news and Mojang news, well, you already know about all the Minecon information because basically that's all we know. We're still waiting on the cape information if you guys buy a ticket and get a cape along with it for your avatar in game. I'll have that right here for you every Monday. Also this week, the 1.6 pre-release came out. Now it is scheduled for full release on July 1st. So you guys will have horses and everybody's gonna be waiting for their server to be updated. Now if you've been watching any of the Minecraft Monday shows for the last two months, I've been talking about everything that's going to be in this, so I'm not going to recover it. Or, you could also watch this 1.6 song that somebody made. Oh yeah, for community awesomeness. Also, so you guys know, this 1.6 update will work with all previous versions of Minecraft. Yes! What's that? There's, there's drama in the air. Drama? Tasty drama? Now when you're a company like Minecraft, a lot of people come to you for deals and a lot of offers, including one that Notch made very public from AVG Antivirus. Don't worry, this isn't a sponsorship by them, that's for sure. As they approached Notch and he even tweeted it back saying that they offered him $20,000 to bundle AVG Antivirus with Minecraft when you download it. Are you serious? $20,000. Last time I checked on the very public Minecraft stats that they make, they sold 17,000 Minecraft in the last 24 hours. That is almost half a million dollars in just 24 hours for a game that has already been created. And they just have to sell the download. Give the download. Give the download away. Yeah. Nacho is pretty straightforward to handle that one as well. And I know I wouldn't talk about stats and how many are sold because we get the idea that Minecraft sells a lot. But I have to because this is kind of crazy. Minecraft is now the fourth largest selling desktop game in the world. Up there with Battlefield and StarCraft. That's insane as well. I'm honestly surprised we haven't seen MLG Pro Leagues going on right now. We always have these tournaments that go on and everything else. But come on, those are two games that have very high competitive standards. So I'm really shocked that we don't see big League of Legends versions and like that of Minecraft go on. And a bonus for people who own the Mac. You now have Cobalt available for you. There you go. Now I'm done talking about news because I'm all about the community here. You guys, all of us. I want to hug you one by one at Minecon in Orlando, Florida. High five me if you see me. Just be like, ah! and then I'll think you're attacking me and then I may punch you. But besides that, I'll probably hug you. Let's get right into your videos and what you guys have been up to. Now, Weed Lion, you may have heard of him. He is a rigger, a known rigger in the community, and he is now animating and he just started his animation channel. And he couldn't have done it more perfectly. This video that he came out with, his very first one out of the gate, is outstandingly smooth. You will almost think that you're watching a Pixar movie. It's called The Catch, and I can guarantee you're going to see a lot more of this guy. Winky face. But I also have this one called The Beginning, and this is by an upcoming animator. This is simply just a cute little skit about a brand new guy jumping into Minecraft, and he has to learn everything the hard way. You guys have been busy this week. As for more videos, we all know the villagers look like Squidward from Spongebob, but it was missing something to sound like him. This creator pushes the limits, and now you have to deal with Squidward everywhere you go, and anytime you want to trade or try to murder them. Yeah. I don't think I want this, but if you do, it's downloadable. Now they did this simply with the new resource pack, how you can easily change out sounds. But somebody went even a step further, the Knox crew, and they made it an adventure map. It is a very short one, but woo, it is outstanding. You get introduced, get a little storyline, and everything is synced up with all the audio. It's pretty awesome. 
I can guarantee you something amazing is about to happen very soon on these adventure map ideas. Now last year I was lucky enough to go to E3 and I cannot wait for Watch Dogs. Can anybody else not wait for Watch Dogs? Like the video. Holy hell I cannot wait for this. Hackers GTA? Yes please! But anyway, if you're still hooked on Minecraft, well then here's a transition video for you. The Watch Dogs trailer, the beginning at least, remade in Minecraft. As for your parody this week, somebody kicked it old school! Oh yeah, I got some Johnny Cash all up in here. It's great to see some of you guys going for the oldies. Come on, great job on this as well. Very simple, smooth animation. They kept it simplistic to get the Johnny Cash feel. Don't be rushed, just look bad doing everything. And yes, Minecraft Misadventures 4 is out! Oh, I love this series so much. It takes forever to draw them and it's just such a great comedy style. Enjoy it, and be sure to shout diamonds to you in all those video comments. They know you're with the Vox Force. Woo, that was a lot of videos. You guys have been up to a lot in the community this week. Next up is all about the things you can download called HOLY SH- <laughs> Did you see that in Minecraft? All these are fully downloadable. Let's get started. Paintball Kitty takes her top maps and puts them in this download for you so you can go ahead and die. I'm not kidding. One of the maps are only known for three people beating it. Legit. Nobody else has ever beat it. Legit. Now there's always tons of cities available for you guys, but now we have a Japanese metropolis. Go ahead. I love just blowing up towns. It's cool. In Minecraft. I'm sorry. Sorry. Don't wiretap me. Oh. Then simply, a large freaking airship. Why not? Oh, but you know what your map is missing? No, no, no. I don't care who you are. You know what it's missing? You know what it's missing? A TNT cannon that can shoot 900 TNT blocks a minute. Yeah. That's what it's missing. Or your friend's town is missing when you aim it that way. Huh? Time for your mod. Now, Minecraft is missing something, and it's missing an upgrade for all of its mobs. This entire thing focuses on doing one thing, putting your mobs on steroids. The mob battle mod makes Enderman throw blocks, teleports smash to you, and even more, that's just getting started, mutant zombies that have a Hulk smash, a roar, and a throw attack. Mutant creepers even spawn minions to kill you. They also have a jump and a charge attack. The thing can even summon lightning. Lightning? Why? It doesn't even stop there. There's slimes and snow golems. Ha! Ah, I need to stop talking about that mod. It, it puts stress on me just even thinking about a world full of those things. But I do have a texture pack for you. Meh. Now, most HD texture packs focus too much on detail and realism putting them together. And you're like, nah, I know it's not a real world. You don't need to make it photorealistic. This is all about keeping it modern and clean looking with the Flows HD texture packs. Even the paintings look like ones you would buy at Target. I always like the focus on texture packs that blend together well and complement other textures. So this easily does it. Now go ahead and use the shader on this thing. Oh man, you're just in beast mode then. You're gonna have an outstanding video. As for your seed this week, well, why have a seed when you can make your perfect world with a world painter program and have it downloadable? Go and get your hands on that one. It's pretty outstanding. All right, all right. I'll give you a seat also, though. Hmm? With 1.6 coming out, what better than giving you the most perfect horse seed, right? With this thing, horses spawn a plenty. Just about every version of them, except for the skeleton and zombie, of course. Also, why not? A bonus ravine right at spawn, a pumpkin patch, and very small biomes, which is odd. You have a snow, a jungle, and a mountain all right there. It's really weird seeing them that small, but they're all within one minute walking distance. Contest time, congratulations to the Vox Force. You four winners have got 25 bucks each to go spend at Jinx.com. Yay! Now if you guys want to enter, be sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below. And you never know, you could be picked at random. But also, your Creeper Bar question of the week, I want to know, are you going to Minecon? And if you aren't, where should have Minecon been held? Or also say, what do you think Minecon should include this year? We've seen two years of it already. They have panels, they have a lot of great stuff they talked about. But what do you think is something that they missed? What do you think they should have? I gotta say, I cannot wait until Minecon. It's always so awesome to see you guys to just... Ah, it's so surreal and crazy, but if you guys can't go, hey, don't worry about it. I'm here for you. Here every week. You know? By the way, we are working on tons of videos right now. We're working on a few music videos, several, many months in the works. I cannot wait for you guys to see them. Ah, they're so exciting. That's all I can say. Also, Cube World, ah, I have closed alpha access to this. If you don't know what it is, be sure to check out the video at the end of the episode. 
and I've been doing Let's Plays for it on Bebop Fox Gaming. Oh my god, it's so exciting and so much fun. But hey guys, that's it for me. Happy Monday, and I'll see you every week and throughout the week. As always, diamonds to you, and happy Minecrafting. <laughs>